Hey Magical Family, it's Craig from the Wizarding Sibs, and welcome to our channel where we share our love for things Harry Potter related, including the latest game coming out, Hogwarts Legacy. The Hogwarts Legacy team released sneak peeks of the common rooms for all four houses, and in this video, I will be reacting and commenting on each of them. If you haven't noticed, I am in Gryffindor. That was from the Pottermore quiz a long time ago, as well as my chosen house. And we do have visions of the Gryffindor and Slytherin common rooms from the movies, but I'm excited to see how the Hogwarts Legacy team has interpreted this into their own. Let's get into it. Okay, so we're starting with Slytherin. Wow, you're like in a cave. I love the green glow that you get. It's very grand, all the stonework. Oh, and it's and you're underwater. It's in the dun it's in the dungeons, the Slytherin common room. I think this is the entrance, how you get in. <laughs> they show that in one of the trailers, that's really cool. I wonder how plants grow down here. Like how much how much light they actually get. Beautiful. It's some cozy chair suit. Oh, I love the water coming down from there. Let's do Hufflepuff next. Uh, they do show some of the Hufflepuff common room in the gameplay showcase videos, which I reviewed in a recent video. So I have seen some of it, but I like to show how they present it as a sort of like, welcome to the common room. Wow, yes. It looks so cozy here. I love the warm colors and the plants everywhere. I love the circular doors too. Very hobbity. Very Lord of the Rings. Is the entrance around the kitchens. Ooh, I love the music. They mentioned that each song for each of the common rooms is slightly different. Hufflepuff is based off of Earth. They get very earthen tones here. Oh, I love all the plants in the circular rooms. Very cozy place. Ooh, in this lookout. Love that. Alright, next up, Ravenclaw. Very clean. Got the harp there. Music. Ooh, oh, I love the music. Yeah. I see a flu powder network there. I love how airy it feels. All the grand windows. Like you could study there. Just get in an armchair and study. Okay, here's the entrance. Ooh, chills how the how the raven opens. It's so sunny. Like I could just see myself cozying up on one of these chairs and reading a good book. And the skylight. Got some astronomy. I'm just like in awe of everything and we'll have to go into all of these in more detail when the actual game comes out. It's just so much detail. Last but not least, let's do Gryffindor. Mm. I do get movie vibes. Some homage to it. Very warm wood colors. Here's the fat lady portrait. <laughs> wow. It looks so cozy. All the carpets and tapestries. 
Looks like a save point, that that astrolobe globe. <laughs> I love the moving portraits. You can look out over the atrium. Cozy chandeliers. All right, so there you have it. My quick reactions to all four of the different common rooms that are coming to Hogwarts Legacy. I'm really excited for how all of these look and just exploring all the attention to detail that they have in the common rooms and the little tidbits or Easter eggs that they might leave us. Let me know in the comments section below which was your favorite common room to look at as well as what house you belong to. Just from those videos, I think my favorite common room would actually be Hufflepuff because of just the earthen tones, the plants, that hobbity look, and being so close to the kitchens. I wonder if you can sneak a few things from there. But I'm hoping that in game, even if you belong to a different house, I'm hoping you can still find your way to these other common rooms and explore them. Or you can do multiple playthroughs of the game as a student from each of the house each time. Again, they do mention that the music is slightly differently themed for each of the common rooms, and just listening to it on my headphones was delicious. It sounded so good. All right, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're hoping to follow us for more Hogwarts Legacy content, and give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this reaction. See you around, Knox.